Hello everybody, this is Kevin with Inspiring How You See That. We're the inspirational channel that goes behind the scenes, talks to some of your favorite artists, entertainers, and much more. So we're back with a Tech Tuesday here again with uh, OBS and talking a little bit about the, the OBS uh, system. And we'll have several segments within OBS. There's a lot you can do with that, uh, especially if you do utilize OBS. So today we're gonna to be talking a little bit about the uh, display capture. So it's the back screen here. Um, right now, this is just an image capture. Um, and you'll see here, uh, there's several different things within my sources um, for display capture. So this is basically how you do that. And you know, there we could be you know here for hours going into how the settings all work and stuff and that's why we're going to be doing different segments within that so do make sure you like subscribe so that way you'll get a notification when there's something new coming out that we're doing within obs because these are going to be short small segments so each one will have a different helpful tip within it and so that way too you guys can comment on it you know send us a you know, even an email or a, a message, Instagram, whatever it may be, and say, hey, I'm, I'm stuck on this, or, you know, there's an issue here, I'd like you to do, you know, a short video on that. We will try to get to those as quick as we can. All right, so today we're gonna be talking a little bit about the display capture images and things like that. We, we had some questions about the backdrop, uh, how to capture some of that, especially if you're doing gaming. So you'll go down to this little plus here, and if, if you're doing gaming, you'll wanna click Game Capture. And you can, when you click on that, you can go in, you can name, you know, like we have uh, Empire Ants, it's, a, it's another gaming uh, game that, um, that was uh, being played through the gaming channel that we uh, also work on too as well. So if you wanted that one, you could do that or you can create a new one and then you just type in there. So depending upon what you're you know, playing, I'm not sure, uh, Roblox, uh, you know, fighting games or a Tom Clancy, you know, which is a cool, you know, game, whatever, whatever it may be. Um, you just put the name in there and then you click OK. So once that's in there, as you see, we have our empire all the way down here because we're not utilizing that. What we're doing is we're utilizing this image here. So if you want, you can move these around. Um, don't don't go up too far because you want you, your audio up here and your microphone and your webcam first, because if I overlay this over my webcam, then you'll see the whole screen and you won't see me. So those will give you some, some helpful tips on the display capture. We'll go into more in depth into, you know, move, maybe moving these around, or if you wanna, you know, you're having an issue with capturing your game and it isn't coming up, because sometimes that does happen. And that's all within the settings and refreshing your computer or iPad or laptop, whatever your uh, system you're utilizing. So that'll give you a little bit of a helpful tips here on the uh, display capture for gaming, pictures, recording, whatever, you, whatever you're um, working on out there. So again, we hope this helps. Uh, make sure that you put in anything that uh, you maybe held up on in your comments or something that you can help, you know, that might help us out. Uh, we're always looking for helpful tips and we're always wanting to expand our knowledge here within the editing and whatever, uh, you know, Brian and I are doing. So again, we hope this helps and we'll see you on the next one.